Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the generic Bluetooth adapter error code 19 that you are experiencing on your Windows 10 computer, where it says that Windows cannot start the hardware devices because its configuration information in the registry is incomplete or damaged. And then it says code 19. So should be a pretty straightforward process here guys and without further ado let's go ahead and jump straight into it so first thing I'm gonna recommend what we do here is just restart your computer so I mean I could demonstrate that here just restart and then see if that resolves a problem next thing you can do is open up the start menu type in troubleshoot best result should come back with troubleshoot settings go ahead and left click on that select on the right panel here additional troubleshooters and then underneath find and fix other problems, select Bluetooth, find and fix problems with Bluetooth devices, and then select run the troubleshooter. And then select next, follow along with any recommended suggestions it offers. Another thing we can do here is if we open up the start menu and type in device manager, and we navigate over to that. If your device is Bluetooth capable, there should be a Bluetooth section here, in which case you would double click on it, and then there should be a Bluetooth device listed under it. You would right click on it and select update driver. You would then select browse my computer for drivers, and then select let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Select the default one or whichever one is the manufacturer specific one. If there's two to pick from, go with the manufacturer one. If there's only one generic one, you just go with whatever options you have available. And then you select next, and then you select close to finish that. And then once you're done with that, you just would close out of here, restart your computer, and see if that does resolve the problem. You can also try actually uninstalling that driver too. So instead of right clicking and updating it, you could right click and remove it, restart your computer, plug your Bluetooth device back in, or if there's any sort of installation media that you downloaded initially to connect your computer to your Bluetooth device, then you would install it again basically from scratch and then hopefully at that point the connectivity problem would have been resolved you can also attempt the system restore it's just an additional option that you're welcome to search my channel for if you're unfamiliar with the process of how to do that so pretty straightforward process guys do hope that i was able to help you out and i do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial goodbye